Echo Road by Kendra Elliott is a story that intertwines themes of murder, mystery, secrets, and romance, all set against the backdrop of a small town with a haunting past. As the third book in the Columbia River series, this novel once again draws readers into a world where the serene beauty of the Pacific Northwest is challenged by the darkness of unresolved crimes and interpersonal conflicts. The novel's protagonist, Ava McLean, is a special agent with the FBI. Having recently suffered a personal loss, Ava is on leave from her job. However, her attempts at taking a respite are thwarted when she gets drawn into a decades-old cold case that has resurfaced and is haunting her own family. The history of Echo Road stretches back over 20 years when a series of violent murders shook the town. The killer was never caught, inflicting a wound on the community that never fully healed. The locals referred to the murderer as the Echo Killer due to the site where the bodies were found, and the case has since become an unsettling local legend. Ava's interest in the cold case becomes personal when she discovers a family connection. Her partner, Mason Callahan, who is a detective with the Oregon State Police and previously assisted on her cases, appreciate the complexity and the grave implications of the case. Together, they embark on a journey to unravel the mysteries of the past. As Ava digs deeper into the investigation, she unearths secrets that many in the town would prefer to keep buried. The original investigation was marred by numerous discrepancies, leading Ava to question the motives and actions of those involved. She is particularly suspicious of law enforcement's previous handling of the case and the possibility of a cover-up. Meanwhile, Ava's professional detachment from the Echo Road case is tested as she confronts the impact of the murders on her own family, which only intensifies her commitment to finding the truth. Ava's relationship with Mason is a grounding force in her life, and their personal connection adds layers to the way they work together on the case. Throughout their investigation, Ava and Mason encounter various residents whose lives were shaken by the long-standing terror of the murderer. These include family members of victims, individuals who were prime suspects at the time, and others with tangential connections that are only now surfacing with the renewed scrutiny. The investigation is complicated by a fresh murder that bears striking similarities to the original crimes. This lead suggests that either the original killer has returned, or a copycat is using the Echo Killer's modus operandi for their twisted purposes. Ava and Mason are tasked with the challenge of determining if the killings are connected or if this is a distinct, although related, series of events. Another significant character in the narrative is Xander Wells, a man who as a young boy discovered one of the victims of the Echo Killer. His traumatic experience and the subsequent treatment by the authorities have left deep scars, and he has spent most of his adult life trying to escape the shadow of Echo Road. His personal journey intersects with Ava's investigation, and he may hold key information that could lead to the capture of the killer. As Ava and Mason piece together the fragments of the past and present, they find that the murderer they are hunting is chillingly calculative and elusive. The killer's ability to stay hidden for two decades suggests a level of cunning and resourcefulness that makes solving the case all the more difficult. They contend with false leads, red herrings, and the killer's attempts to misdirect the investigation. The novel also explores the psychological toll the investigation takes on those involved. For the detectives, the pressure to solve the case and prevent further deaths weighs heavily on their minds. The victims, families grapple with a mix of hope for closure and the terror of revisiting their darkest days. As the narrative progresses towards its climax, Ava and Mason close in on the killer with the help of new forensic technology and a deeper understanding of the killer's psyche derived from their collected evidence and victim profiles. The breakthrough comes when they least expect it, forcing them to reevaluate their theories and leading them to a conclusion that is both shocking and satisfying. In the final confrontation, Ava and Mason face off against the Echo Killer with the truth of the 20-year-old mystery finally coming to light. The resolution is intense and emotional as the killer's identity and motives are unveiled, revealing deep-seated obsessions and a disturbing rationale. In the end, Ava's relentless pursuit of justice, support from Mason, 
and the resilience of Echo's residents bring a measure of closure to the town and justice for the victims. The community of Echo Road can finally begin to heal, and Ava and Mason's relationship emerges stronger, ready to face whatever challenges may come their way in the future. The resolution of the Echo Killer case closes a painful chapter for the people of Echo Road, and Ava and Mason's investigation demonstrates the enduring power of truth and the lengths to which people will go in the name of love and justice. With the killer behind bars, Echo Road can finally live up to its name, a mere echo of the horrors that once plagued its residents, now fading into memory as the community looks toward a calmer, brighter future. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.